Please excuse the messy trunk. That's not what this video is about. We're gonna get to that right now. Okay, so in this video, uh, I want to talk about something that I kind of wanted to kind of address for a long time. I just didn't think that I shouldn't address it. But um, this video is about shoes, uh, and not necessarily shoes in general, but being a dancer uh, and how I treat my sneakers, shoes, uh, tennis shoes, whatever you want to call them. Uh, that's what this kind of video is about. So I just wanted to pull all these shoes out real quick to talk about that. So these shoes right here, the ones you're looking at, uh, these are some Aldo's that I bought in Tampa, right? Um, these are probably my favorite pair of shoes that I have, except for the fact that I was dancing and I messed them up uh, dancing. And that's pretty much how all of these pairs of shoes got messed up, is through dancing. Um, and I just wanted to kind of explain, oh, I gotta turn the mic around again, okay. And I kind of wanted to explain why I don't know, I have this problem. For one, um, I'm not a big sh sneakerhead, shoe head. I don't spend a lot of money on shoes. Like the most I spend on shoes for myself is like, at most, these are like 90 something, right? Um, that's probably the most I'll go over to spend for myself. For someone else, like my dad, like maybe like 150 at most. But uh, I'm just not a big sneakerhead. So uh, what I look for in shoes when it comes to dancing, um, cause that's how I kind of shop for clothes and shoes is that can I dance in it is it comfortable does it look good right um, so all these shoes are kind of like lightweight that's I'm a lightweight shoe person none of my shoes are heavy um, so I can't do a lot a lot of toe spin moves uh, in my shoes uh, actually I don't really do any toe spin moves anymore I do a lot of like, ankles on the side stuff but um, these right here uh, I had these shoes for like a week and um, I messed them up in the first week of dancing, um, probably at, at a session or something, and there was a hole, this is like the first hole that these shoes got, um, and the other shoe is just terrible compared to that, like, you see all that? Messed these up uh, at another session, <laughs> um, downtown, on concrete, um, all my shoes are just very lightweight, it's like a lot of fabric, um, not a lot of um, heavy duty. Uh, and these vans I have right here. I guess I would consider these just like my practice shoes because obviously I can't wear these anywhere. Um, I, I wouldn't wear these anywhere either, but uh, these I, I probably practice in these more than anything uh, for when it comes to dancing. But the shoes I'm wearing right now, uh, the latest addition to uh, the family. These uh, are the latest addition of my shoe collection. I wouldn't even call it a collection, but these are what I have that are not messed up at the moment. Uh, I'm going to try to not mess them up because I'll use these for dancing. All of these. I can still try to rock these guys right here. I can still rock those. Uh, I just got to be careful and maybe try to glue the bottom part or something. But, uh, oh, and excuse the pool. We don't use that anymore, but I know it's dirty. I'm sorry. Uh, but yeah, uh, when it comes to dancing, I'll try to keep these or like at least one or two pair in my trunk and not mess these shoes up. Had to film all that in my backyard. Uh, it's kind of dark out, so it's gonna be dark in, and I don't like using the indoor lighting. So, yeah. Actually, I think uh, I'm gonna see a few other dancers today, so I'm gonna get their opinion on, uh, I don't know, just their whole philosophy on their shoes and stuff. Um, yeah. This is QJ, by the way, everybody, just in case you didn't know that. What up, what up? Tell them about this shoe problem. All right, so this right here, <laughs> We got connected with Seabass, my dude, Clayton. Yeah, like one of the pioneers of step-by-step -step dance, one of the broadband masses of just dance filming in general. So, he came to Jacksonville, Florida, 
we shot two concept videos. And those two concept videos, basically, um, I bought me a fresh pair of shoes because I was like, yo, man, I'm gonna look fresh for this occasion. So, and these right here, these old schools right here. Right there. So, you know, I'm like, yes, man, they cool, they fresh. Just came from a Jacksonville Jaguar game and all. Like, I was ready. Next thing you know, we got done. Soon as we got done, this is the outcome of what I got. And they was even, like, I haven't even had them for a month. Like, Wait, was, what year is this? What year ooh, did this happen? Ooh, I'm gonna say probably 2017 or 2016. No, 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 no. no it's gotta be 2016. I'll say 2016. Yeah, I, I, I feel like I remember that one. Speaking yeah. of which, Cam, uh, you got any, like, shoe stories where you, like, messed up a good pair of your shoes? So, I was at this performance. It was a Martin Luther King uh, performance. Mm. And uh, me, QJ, and his dude named Mike, we really didn't battle each other. But that's, we were kind of battling each other, just a little bit from a distance. Um, and I ended up doing this slide with my foot and I ripped the whole bottom of my babe soft. Because they're fake, to be honest. But oh, they look oh, real. Dang. Yeah, they, they I were I would fake. never say that on camera. <laughs> 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 but yeah, dude, I did, I did one cool move and just like tore the whole bottom off. Dude. Okay. Yeah. What kind of shoe style do you go for usually? Um... For right now, as I get older, I'm going with, um, I was always into like uh, Converse's, uh, Vans, but I'm really gonna get into like the old school, like Adidas, Cortez's. Okay. I wanna go back to uh, Nike Dunks as well. See, like, yep. go ahead. But yeah, that, that's what I wanna go towards too. Like I said earlier, for me, I like like lightweight shoes, cause like, I don't know, I just move better in them, but I can't do any toe moves, cause that's gonna mess me up yeah. for good. You're right. Like, QJ right here, like he can do a lot of toe stuff, I assume. Oh, yeah. yeah, all force field stuff. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Appreciate you for watching this video. Hey, uh, I ain't subscribe. Good shoes oh, no more, like okay? Yeah, all the trash shoes I'm gonna yeah, dance in. Yeah, all shoes, shoes and you just. <laughs> <laughs>